Last week, a group of former Special Operations Forces and CIA officers, many with ties to the Republican Party, the Tea Party groups, and the birthers, have launched an attack on President Obama over his handling of the bin Laden raid last year. They accused the president of leaking information about the operation and taking too much credit for its success. Well, this week, the group came under strong criticism from fellow Special Forces and other military leaders. As the Associated Press reported, some officers say the group is breaking a sacred military creed, respect for the commander-in-chief. The Associated Press quotes one Green Beret who wrote on his Facebook page, quote, this is an unprofessional, shameful action on the part of the operators that appear in the video, period. And on Tuesday, the top U.S. general, the head of the Joint Chiefs of Staff, Marty Dempsey, Martin Dempsey, weighed in with his criticism. Let's listen. The American people don't want us to be another special interest group. But if someone uses the uniform, whatever uniform it is, uh, for partisan politics, I'm, I'm disappointed by that. Because I think it does erode that bond of trust we have with the American people. So did this group cross a line? I think so. But will their message find a receptive audience on the right?